Back out to us here in the Acadian Alive kitchen. Change of set uh, in the break we had. Uh, we have Mr. Doug O'Connor here now, and we met you last year, but it's yes. been a whole year since I I've gotten it. to see you. you. We had to bump some people off to get on the show. I feel privileged. Thank you so much. Of course. Yeah. Had to celebrate National Ice Cream Month, um, and uh, it comes at the perfect time of year, too, of course. I'm sure it was planned out that way. July, Absolutely. one of the hottest times of the year, especially South Louisiana, got a cool off with some Bluebell ice cream. Six flavors to try yes. today. So Ronald Reagan in 1984 decided that uh, 90 percent of the households ate some kind of ice cream mm -hmm. and he decided to make it a declaration and he described uh, or he made third the third Sunday in July the National Ice Cream Day. Okay. So uh, we're here to celebrate ice cream and mm -hmm. we've got summer flavors. We've got our peaches and homemade. We've got our uh, southern blackberry cobbler, our strawberries and homemade, our Java Jote that came out recently. It's a described as coffee ice cream with dark chocolate chunks mm -hmm. and a coffee fudge swirl. Ooh. It's really great. And Dr. Pepper Float that mm -hmm. came out recently has been the hit for the summer. It's been out. And our newest one is Monster Cookie Dough. Mm -hmm. So Monster Cookie Dough is vanilla ice cream with peanut butter cookie dough pieces in oh, it. Oh, it's peanut butter cookies. Exactly. Okay. And then it's got candy coated pieces in it and mm. it's got some uh, dark chocolate chunks as well. So, but I wanted to talk about these variety for the summer because uh -huh. we've just been so busy and we try to typically keep 30 flavors out. The mm -hmm. summer has been really great. Yeah. And the beauty of Bluebell is a DSD company, direct store delivery. So we're the ones handling the ice cream mm -hmm. from receiving it to putting on the shelves. I see them Bluebell trucks I out know. there. I love it. I, I love guys. it. Would you like to try one particular? I do. I yeah. do. I really want to try the coffee one. I'm a coffee girl and I love that it's the dark chocolate mm -hmm. pieces in there because I think that just goes so well with the coffee flavor. I love it. So I'm going to try that. I'm just going to take this yeah, spoon from spoon. right here. Absolutely. I haven't tried the Dr. Pepper one either though. So Dr. Pepper is vanilla ice cream with a Dr. Pepper sherbet swirl. Oh, sherbet yes, swirl. exactly. Okay. What they found is if you use a, an ice cream, a Dr. Pepper ice cream, it's too strong. This mm -hmm. enhances the flavor just perfectly and tastes just like a Dr. Pepper because it, you know, it's not going to be overwhelming. Mm -hmm. So. I love this one. Wait, this one, this one's good. Now this one's only out in pints, so it's a, a oh. perfect item to come out with in the summer. Uh, if you're looking for pint size, mm -hmm. uh, we have approximately 20 flavors out in pints right now. So just producing as fast as we can. I think it takes about 70,000 cows a day to provide milk for us to make oh, ice wow. cream. Oh, wow. Yeah. And where, so. so where are, where's the Bluebell headquarters or maybe the Bluebell farm? Absolutely. So we're, uh, our corporate headquarters are in Brenham, Texas. Mm -hmm. And they started there in 1907, started making ice cream in 1911, making two gallons a day, which is one more of these. Yeah. And then they would take it to their area of uh, local people and sell whatever they could. And then they would literally eat the rest because they didn't have a way to store it back then. Right. In the 30s, refrigerator freezer came out. So Brenham is about 90 miles northwest of Houston, Texas. Okay. So we have a plant there, and then we have support plants uh, outside of Tulsa, uh, Oklahoma, and then one in Sylacauga, Alabama. So it's really a, a southern made uh, product, right? which I didn't realize. I mean, I kind of always assumed that it was a southern made right. thing. But um, yeah, and I love one of my favorite things is I don't think the, the packaging has ever really changed. It's pretty true to form. Now yeah. we have gotten a little bit more aggressive with the like these flavors right here. Right, maybe like, the like yeah, ones, the, like the, the peaches logo. and homemade, mm -hmm. strawberries and homemade, southern blackberry cobbler. Those are all been pretty standard colors, yeah. And sure. I love that because it reminds me of my childhood and eating bluebell at my grandparents' oh. house and I love it. Well, Mr. Doug, thank, thank you. you so much for joining thank us you again. Thank you for having me today. Thank Absolutely. You. Go get your bluebell for National Ice Cream Month before it ends in just a few days.